Welcome back to Pokemon Blue, everybody. I do not know where we're going to go today. We're probably just going to roam around, explore, maybe catch a few Pokemon. What's down here? Oh, hey. Oh, bump the mic. Let me fix that right quick. Alright, cool. We... are outside of Vermilion City, so we can go grab our bike now. I also need to go find that guy that's going to give us the item finder. This is not the right house. Is this it? Nope. Got to be this one. Yes, yes I did. You talk a lot. Alright, so we got a bike voucher now. So now we can shoot back up to Cerulean City, exchange it for a bike instead of paying like one million dollars, and we'll be able to go a little bit faster. Although, really and truly this late in the game, it doesn't make that much of a difference. Because, well, I, I guess this is about the time that you would be getting it anyway. We're, we're probably... I think you can get it, you know, one badge ago. We, we've probably gotten an extra badge before going to get it. But hey, it's, it's whatever, right? That building over there is the Pokemon Daycare. Uh, that is where you would leave a Magikarp if you catch one. You leave it there, and you come back at the end of the game, and you pull it out, give it the EXP share, and get a Gyarados. A freaking crook. I wouldn't give you a million dollars for one of these bikes ever. Alright, let's cut this again. And I believe in this game you can ride your bikes through the uh the little guard tunnel things. Nope. It must be gold and silver where they started letting you do that. Or maybe even after. Alright, so from here we need to head back towards Lavender Town, go south. And because we have the Poke Flute, we can wake up that Snorlax and continue on our journey. like this bike music. Oh, we have to go through that tower. Oh. You give me something? Alright! What's this TM? That I probably won't use. Swift? I will actually hold on to Swift because 
it's a decently strong attack, and it has a very high accuracy. Let's get back on the bike. Could I have already come this way? I could have swore it was a Snorlax down here. I guess I could throw my rod in the water and catch a Magikarp right quick. So we should be getting close to a fisherman that will give us the, the good rod. Or the better rod. I don't know, there's three different rods. I think there's three. I know there's at least two, because the old rod only catches magic orbs. I know I need to get that experience share soon, though. Which we should be pretty close to finding that aid. Right around here, actually. I wonder what it'll be. try a great ball after this one it's only level five so great ball should be I, I would think a great ball could catch it with this this uh, HP level good deal good deal that bring us up to? Well, we own 32. I know we need 50 to get that experience share. So I'll have to figure out what I haven't caught and all that good stuff. I'll probably do some backtracking off camera and catch them. You know, you gotta catch them all. <laughs> Speaking of gotta catch them all, and I've probably already said this, but people that don't see the play or the yeah the play on words with the anime, Ash catch them, catch them all. People that don't get that are uh, oh it just it it irks me. How do you not pick up on that? Anything good up here? Nope. Okay. Fight me. Not that it's going to be much of a fight, because I'm just going to cut your people all up. I feel like I should have already been here because the the level difference between these trainers and Sabrina it just feels like these guys are are significantly lower. But I guess 
the developers thought, hey, they'll probably go this way, fight all these trainers, and then realize, oh, we can't go any further because there's a freaking Snorlax in the way. So, I, I guess that kind of makes sense, but I don't know. It just seems like they should be a little higher regardless. But I guess if they were higher level, that would be like, oh, well, I shouldn't be going here right now. I need to go find somewhere else to go. Back edges. I want a horsey. I don't know why. Kind of reminds me of Cubert. Which is a game that I never understood as a kid. Oh, hey! It's Snorlax. I like in the future games where... Alright, we're gonna save right quick. Why are you saving? Because I'm gonna catch it. I like in future games where, like, if you come across something like this... It automatically does the action for you. Kind of like when you walk up to a tree that can be cut. You just tap A and it automatically pulls the Pokemon out. Snorlax. Alright, let's leech him. Because even if he goes to sleep, it doesn't cure leech seed. It will remove poison, though. Alright. I'm... I'm only going to use Tackle because I don't want to overdo it with Razor Leaf. Stop using rest! Mm. Alright, don't use rest. No! Ah! All right, well, I'm gonna reset. Be right back. All right, wake up, you freaking Snorlax. Let's try this again. See, that's why I saved. Because Tackle only did this much damage that whole time, and then all of a sudden it was like... What, what, what is that? Alright, this time, I'm not screwing around. Let's just raise your leaf right off the bat and hope it doesn't kill him. Well, guess I'm resetting again. Alright, let's try it. Come on, just stay in the great ball. Not even a slight chance. You really gotta regain full health. That's so lame. I mean, good if you intend to, you know, tank somebody out.
Alright, don't go to sleep. Alright, let's try another ball. This is it. I can feel it. This is gonna be it. Don't know what I was feeling, but that certainly was not it. Oh, see, now here's the problem with poison and leech seed is if we don't catch it on this one, it just ain't gonna happen. Do we have a Ultra Ball? No. No. Ah! Why couldn't you go to sleep? <sighs> Come on. Stay in the ball. This dude will not stay in the ball. Like, it's not even getting to two shakes. This is crazy. Finally! After, like, I don't know, what, five different tries? A lot of Pokeballs? No. I do not want to give a nickname to them. Alright. We can stop off here and grab the item finder right quick. Oh, but our pack is going to be full. I can't believe our pack wasn't full. Alright. I don't know how often I'm actually going to use the item finder. And I'm going to get back on my bike, because I... I want to make it to the next town. Who are you? Yeah, well, your Voltorb doesn't have a chance, so... Also, this guy is low level. So, were we supposed to come here before going up against Sabrina? Is, is that... That doesn't make any sense. Because we can't... You're not supposed to be... Well, yeah... I don't know. I guess. Maybe. Maybe. I don't, I don't know. I, I don't know. I don't know. I don't even know if I said it in this episode or maybe the last episode. This whole area just seems odd with the level, the leveling aspect. All right, I got the super rod. Now I can catch something besides magic arts. So let's give it a whirl right quick. Nothing. Nothing. Well, we got some. All right. Hey, it's Goldine. Let's just leech and poison it. Okay. That's a thing. All 
Alright, then we're just gonna sit here and uh, let Leech Seed do its thing. Oh, now poison powder works. All right, well we can we can get there twice as fast now. All right, I'm gonna try ball. Goldeen, you're such a tease. It ought to stay now, though. Alright, we're well on our way to 50. No, no nickname. in that ball. I gotta know what's in that ball. Magikarp, are you serious? I don't think I needed to waste a razor leaf on you. I probably could have killed you with tackle. Also, you have a level 24 Magikarp. Why did you not let it evolve? You have two level 24 Magikarps. You could have had two Gyarados. What is your deal? I could get more experience from wild Pokemon than that. How'd that bush grow back so quick? Alright, let's go ahead and get that iron to Venusaur, because our pack is getting pretty full. And I don't want to miss out on any good items. And what I do want to do is I kind of want to skate around these guys in hopes that I can make it to the next town. And we'll come back and fight these guys in the next episode, of course. Alright, well, while we're here, what's in the grass? Oh, hey, I got one of those. Alright, let's, let's let one more pop up. Got one of those, too. Although... This one's probably ready... to evolve. And that was like the perfect place for that to stop. So I can probably... I can be okay with wasting experience to make that level up so it evolves into Weeping Bell. Go buy a Leaf Stone, get a Victory Bell, and that'll knock out... No, I didn't want to do that. And that'll give me two Pokemon, two Pokemon real quick. Oh, I can't avoid these two. Alright, well, that can be a thing, that's fine. These are probably the last two people I have to fight to get to the next town anyway. I hope. So if you couldn't guess by all the resets and stuff, 
I'm really thinking that I want to have Snorlax on my team, which is why I made sure that I caught him. Not guaranteed, but... Snorlax, with the Poison Powder and the Leech Seed tactics that Venusaur can use, Snorlax can tank that, especially with Rest. So, Snorlax might be joining the team. Why do you have so many birds? Alright, come on. I should actually be hitting level 50 here. I would hope by the end of this battle. Why do you randomly miss? And I didn't stop my timer during all those resets, so... When I look at the timer, I think this episode's going really long, but it's probably only around like the 22 minute mark when my timer says it's been about 30 minutes. Because there were a couple of times that I reset and I just accidentally killed Snorlax in one hit, so y'all didn't even see that. Pikachu, he got no chance. I cut you. Come on, level 50. Level 50. Come on. Give me enough to go level 50. Oh. That's gotta be close. Are we in the next town? Is this the next? We're not in the next. What? No. What? No. No. What is this? Well, I walked right into that one. All right, we we might not make it to the next town before we have to uh, save. In fact, I might just bike right back to where we got the item finder so that we don't have to backtrack through all of this to get to those couple of trainers that I did skip. So, I'm gonna finish up this battle and then that's where I'm gonna call it. I'll do the backtracking off camera. I might also do some evolving off camera. Um, who knows? I will say that I, at this time, I'm not certain when I will be able to record again, or how soon I will have the next set of videos uploaded, because uh, if you don't know, oh, Hurricane Matthew is heading my way, so if it does come here, you know, I can't say for sure if it's going to affect internet or power or if we're going to have to evacuate and all that good stuff. So should that become an issue and there's no videos for a few days, that is more than likely the reason. And all, all I can do is apologize in advance if that happens. If that doesn't happen, then I just probably sound like a jackass right now. But I'd rather let you guys know that that's a possibility than, uh, you know, it'd be a week before the next video is up. I mean, like, well, I guess he must have quit YouTube or, you know, whatever. But that's not the case. But anyway, we'll see what happens. And in the meantime, if you're new, make sure you hit subscribe. If you want to follow on Facebook, Twitter, 
check out the merch shop or if you're interested in checking out Extra Life or making a donation, links for all that is in the description below. And as always, thanks for watching and let's stop.